Gamer. What's going on, sports gamers? Mike Straw, managing editor of Sports Gamers Online here, back again taking a look at some of the new features in MLB The Show 20. So in addition to their defensive live stream on Twitch and YouTube, Sony San Diego Studios came back and did another MLB The Show 20 live stream, this time focusing on some of the new hitting features making their way to the game when it launches this March. But if you didn't have a chance to watch Thursday evening's stream, we've put together this full recap on all the news you need to know about. But before getting into it, be sure to leave a like on this video and subscribe to Sports Gamers Online and hit that bell to be notified whenever a new video goes live so you never miss the latest sports gaming content. So let's get right into the new hitting changes in MLB The Show 20. The all new Perfect Perfect PCI feedback is the biggest new addition to hitting in MLB The Show 20. Gone are the days of just good swing timing and squared up PCI placement resulting in frustrating lineouts all game long. With the perfect perfect PCI feedback, the truly best swings will result in hits at a much higher rate. According to the developers, this result is difficult to achieve and most players will only receive it maybe once or twice per game. However, the top echelon of online players could see this feedback far more often. Now there are three types of perfect perfect swings, perfect grounder, perfect line drive, and perfect fly ball. But just know that even with how rare they are, just because you get one doesn't necessarily mean you're going to end up with a base hit. All it really means is that you're going to have a better opportunity and your player's going to hit the ball as best as they can in that situation. Moving on but sticking with the PCI, for the first time ever in MLB The Show, players will now have the ability to customize the way the PCI looks on their screen beyond the generic options that players are used to in the past. In the stream, they showed off three of these customized PCIs that you can change to how you fit and how you play at the plate. Now when customizing your PCI, there are a variety of options to choose from, such as plate coverage indicator being on and off, the center shapes of the PCI, the inner shapes, the outer shapes, the overall color, the transparency on a 1 to 100 scale, and the PCI fadeout. The screenshot you see here is an example of what that PCI customization screen will look like in MLB The Show 20. Now lastly, the stream covered a new pitching quirk that has been added for hurlers with the rare ability to throw fastballs at or above 100 miles an hour. Players like Araldis Chapman, Jose Alvarado, Jordan Hicks, and Noah Syndergaard will all see velocity increases to their hardest thrown pitches, making pitchers like them even tougher to hit in MLB The Show 20. So sports gamers, that's what's coming to hitting in MLB The Show 20. If you missed the coverage of all of the defensive improvements, Go back and watch that video, and again, be sure to leave a thumbs up on this video and subscribe to Sports Gamers Online so you never miss another MLB video when it goes live, and be sure to visit our website for more continuous coverage at sportsgamersonline.com.